turnout? Uh, there was, they started late for some reason. It was supposed to start at 10, and it went off at 10.30, and booths were still being set up, so it was a bit of a clusterfuck. But um, I would think um, that if you got three or 400 people to that thing, you killed it. I think. Um, and I think that they were in that range. I think they did well enough that it'll be back next year on Cinco de Mayo weekend. Um, you know, it was it was uh, Double B, Bernie Barmashal, and I think Mark Abrams had a hand in it. I even think uh, that our friend had a hand in it. Our friend who I'm not allowed to name on the show for whatever reasons. Are we allowed to say Mario's name? Whatever. Um, Mario was there. I mean, I was just super casual because there were people looking to fucking get me to pay for drinks, so... I kept my cap. <laughs> Hate all you want, Fight Net Radio fans. I stood in the middle, made myself aware for at least a good 20, 30 minutes, tweeted my spot. If you weren't there yet. And again, I got hater tweets on that. Oh, you're hiding. No fucks. I went to go compete in a tournament. <laughs> if you're not there, I got the drink tickets in hand. I will go get your ass drunk. I don't care. I don't care if it's 11 o'clock. It's Vegas. It's afternoon somewhere. I'm I'm totally down. I was at the fights, tweeting my locations constantly. Uh, had a pretty obvious skybox. I had a skybox for Friday. Skybox, Andrew, at a table. Again, go to social media, check it out. Am I, like, jacking off in front of people a little too much there? <laughs> Look at the size of my dick and how awesome I am. I have two silver medals from Saturday. I had a skybox on Friday. I got to meet all these fantastic fighters and take a picture with the WBC belt. And all of you are a bunch of fucking dicks. I guess he's, if you're saying like that, yeah, yeah, you are a little dick a little swinging little right now. Swinging, right? <laughs> and Andrew, why the fuck weren't you here, dude? It was fucking awesome. I know. I could have left yeah. you all day at the Box Fan Expo. I could have handled my business in Henderson, right? And then we would have both gone to dinner and watched it on the laptop. If I would have watched the whole card... I'm not moved. ready for the laptop, Lee. Sorry. You, dude, buffet. Here was what my move was going to be if I went at six. I was going to go to a buffet at six and start live streaming and sit there and watch, you know, all three or four hours and just go constantly <laughs> to make myself plates of food and sit there. But that seemed egregious. So guess what? I become all the waiters favorite person at my favorite steakhouse. And I propped the manager came over. He's like, do you want our private Wi-Fi connection? <laughs> That's exactly what he said. So what are you doing? I said, I'm going to watch the fight. He's like, do you have good Internet? I'm like, uh, yeah, I, I think the one that I'm on works. He goes, I'll give you the internal one if you want the password. I'm like, thanks. I appreciate that. I think we're OK. And here's the thing about the way this was set up. So if you got stalled or disconnected, it paused where you were watching it while it reset. So it continues the fight from exactly where you stopped and started watching it. It never jumped forward if there was a lag. Sound which, like a commercial, Lee. Dude, I'm telling you, it's the future, bro. It's the. It's future. already here. I no, mean, it's even not even the future. Did pay-per-view streaming. Nobody. Well, I, I don't think pay-per-views ever leaving. There's nothing well, ever gonna beat a 72-inch HD don't, screen. Don't get me wrong. Okay. But I've got an HD 20 inch in front of me. Yeah, but that's. <laughs> so again, Andrew, I'm sorry. Were I, you eating? I. Well, yeah, of a course. 40 day rip bone in ribeye tomahawk steak. And no, I had tri tip corn and. Ruffled and mashed potatoes, corn soup. I had baked tell potatoes. you about what I ate, okay? Just to be a dick here. Oh. Okay, started off, of course, with a, you got to have the shrimp cocktail right gotta have it gotta have here it. here we go again with the dick swinging sorry this people dick swinging. do you like carpaccio i love carpaccio right <laughs> the thinly sliced carpaccio meat right with the arugula and the capers and the the sauce fucking brilliant right into the corn and crab bisque into the tomahawk steak with the truffled mashed potatoes and the corn souffle Followed by the creme brulee? Are you fucking kidding me, Andrew? You, but you can do that at any time, Lee. It doesn't have to be during the fight. No, I it's, mean, it's better with the fight, dude. It's like it's literally perfect. I, I get what you're saying about streaming. I know it's place, but I, I don't think it's taking the, the no, place I'm of... No, I'm not saying that. I think this is going... They will yeah, they'll both be side to side. Enhance. 
you're going to look at another million view- look if they did even close to a million on streaming they're going to invest more into it they uh, of are- course of course lee because yes there's and a lot of people they out there it, they literally that can't treated get it. it here's the thing they literally treated it like a bullshit internet thing like they used to with us back in the day when we'd live stream right they were like, treating did it sky like, sports uh, even pick got, this like, fight up i yeah. didn't i didn't see anything on sky sports it last on, night it was on sky it, it was? was okay yeah. yeah 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 absolutely it was but here's the thing because i know that we've done this we've gone and done live streaming of boxing where they just thought oh that's cute you have like a hundred people watching the live stream that's cute really that's more than you got in this fucking arena, asshole. I mean, I don't I don't think that they're going to grasp it until they look at these numbers. And I'm saying it. If they get anywhere in the ballpark north of, I would say it's a success past, what, 100,000 views? What would you deem internet streaming a success at? Uh, well, in a fight like this, yeah, it's got to be up there in the hundred thousands, uh, Lee. Um, this is not, like I said, this is not the first time a, a professional sport has been streamed. So the, everyone that's in tuned with the the internet, they're gonna they know about streaming. You know what I'm saying? Like Top Rank's been doing it. You you came on here talking about the WWE did it years ago. PBC does it, P- and PBC has a great library online. I believe Top Rank even now has their they library they do. online. I so mean, it's not as solid as what it's UFC coming. is. UFC has it. UFC, a little. yeah. UFC, you- UFC and the WWE are major, run by the same companies. Major so, League Baseball yep. has and that's done the, it. By the way, same company that does WWE, Major League Baseball, wow. does the UFC. So it's that really cool click on demand with the app. Like I watch, um, I'm big. You, do you have apps on your TV? Do you? No. Okay. No, I don't. I have like the late, the the newer model of the Samsung where I actually have apps. I'm telling you, I'm not going to have regular cable next year. I'm just going to have the internet and I'm going to watch TV through all my apps. Right. I just am. No, I, I hear it every day, Lee. I do. It's there. It's literally right there. Like I have Netflix, I have Hulu, so that takes care of TV in general, right? You're There's selling- even guys selling these black boxes again. Yep. You, for like eighty bucks, you buy this box and you get everything off of off of streaming. Right. So what do, what do I need? What, what, somebody explain it to me. And I think this t- is why ESPN is firing a hundred uh, uh, workers of a course. day or a month now, now let's, and this let's is why it. cable. Is two hundred and ninety dollars a month. Let's go a step further. Hey, I want to go down to Wings and Things with my boys and have them cater the event in the back room. Um, they got pocket projectors, right? It's my own little private event, and I can plug in a little pocket projector into my laptop and hang out with my boys and watch the fight. They're they're a, gonna. At a I week. think yeah, the, the the millionaires they they're gonna have to find a way to make uh, serious money off of it because you know they say it's hurting the sport sports world. Bullshit. Who knows? Bullshit. I think it's fucking brilliant because here's the thing: while I was getting ready last night, I was already watching the undercard while I was taking my shower on my way back from the fight. Like I was standing in line at the sports book, right, placing my bet at six o'clock. Guess what? I was watching the undercard on my phone. Right. No, I hear you. I hear you. That's fucking great. Tell me how great it is. Look, you'd pay the 60 bucks just to know when to walk in for the main event. If I was a high roller. Hey, right? Lee, when, when you're streaming um, like the Major League Baseball, have you ever done the Major League Baseball site? No, I haven't done theirs, but I've done the WWE, which is the same company. Are there commercials? Yeah, WWE plugs in. Yeah, not a be, lot. Like one. Be, like a because, major sponsor. Yeah, see, and I think that in lies the major problem with with the TV um, situation on streaming. Yes, streaming's good for the company that's actually putting it out there. Not good when you're talking TV companies that get money off of commercials and play multiple commercials through TV breaks. No, and look, the WWE has like Snickers and and ma- like major sponsors, right? But it's so, nothing like when you watch no. it on regular. Yeah. So here's how they do it. Like, let's say their regular programming, like, uh, like let's say NXT, which is their their own produced, only on the web, weekly wrestling show, right? So they will run 
15 minute segments, you know, 10 to 15 minute segments, and then stick in one commercial for Snicker or one commercial for an upcoming pay per view just to break it up as a transition. I'm okay with that. No, the consumer is. The billion dollar TV uh, companies are not. Right. So this in life. But this is why I stopped paying for Sirius. I'll I'll be honest. I stopped paying for Sirius. You know why? Because they started putting commercials on Sirius. Right. Okay, here's the thing. You're going 15 minutes, and it's one or two commercials that people are overpaying for. I get it. Okay, yay, good. It's only two commercials. I pay a monthly fee for no commercials. Zero. Okay, zero. I I pay for Hulu for zero commercials and watch my entire season without having to fucking fight for it. I record all my TV now. Boxing's going to go the same route. I'm... If... People don't get what happened last night. This is the first major fight on stream. And Oscar put zero fucking money or care into it. He put Doug Fisher and Coyote Duran. Don't get me wrong. They call for ring TV. Sh- it was Coyote Duran, huh? Yeah, it was Beto. Because they, they had Mario Lopez working the but, whole uh, week. He had with Steve Kim, and they did the weigh-ins. But the actual play-by-play was wow. the ring All TV right. crew. It was Coyote and... And look, I'm look, I'm friendly with them. I am, I am. I, I don't want to make it sound like I'm a hater. I hate on Steve and Dougie, and look, all of them. I don't think the fans got past our TV talk. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I think they already tuned out on it. Like, yeah. <laughs> it is so. Wait, I'm gonna say this. It's so significant that this event was streamed last night. That we'll we're all going to look back and go and look at this event and go. That's when boxing changed. It is. I'm telling you. It was Canelo? Just no. It, it was Canelo that changed it, huh? I'm telling you that this fight is that much of a big deal. I'm a marketing and media guy, okay? Yes, I'm telling you what my day job is. Um, it is that significant. Like, I can now take this event, once these numbers come out, and go to, like, a Roy Jones Boxing and say, why aren't you streaming at all? And tell that to your sponsors and double the price. You don't even have to put an effort in. There will be an audience for people who just want to see fucking fighting. There just are. I don't care if it's a fucking ballroom card with 12 guys and a chimpanzee. It doubles the amount of money you can make as a promoter. And everybody will start to do it. Everybody. If they don't, they're selling themselves short. That's it. That was my rant. It was 13 minutes of a rant. It felt very Larry Merchant. We'll see the numbers. We will look back on this fight, Jim. And we will see two combatants who didn't really try. But what is significant about this evening, Jim, is that it was streamed. And we will look back on this night and go, that was the day that boxing changed. Canelo will come and go. He will get knocked out by Triple G. But streaming will be with us forever. Back to you, Jim. <laughs> Was that more Larry Merchant-like? Yeah. Did you see? Yeah. In Klitschko, <laughs> Joshua did great numbers, but we got to get... It's one hour and 15 minutes now. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what fight they're watching. I, 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 don't, I don't know what fight you're watching. This... See that German television, what they did for Klitschko? No. 10 million, Lee. Awesome. Yeah. That's pretty a big. All right, that'll do it. This was a long show. We we covered everything. I We, we got it. Analyzed. September, you guys. Shit whole fight. No, t- it's time to fucking tune up the band and get, like, no hype. I am telling you, no motherfucking hype to Kovalev Ward. It's going to do another 400,000 views. Yeah, and- Kovalev, and Kovalev, he's, he's all over this one. Um, He's really hyping up this fight. They... How much he's going after Ward right now, it's, it's going to be a hell of a rematch. Yep, I agree. He made it personal. Yep. And a lot of his memes, he's making this thing personal. I get that. I get that. <laughs> All right, Lee. Apparently there was a party at my house while I was gone. And my uh, entire household is really, really sick and hungover with alcohol poisoning. Oh, shit. 
<laughs> this is what